or chair. I've got this one assembled as you can see. I've got it sort of resting on its back. The triangle part here of the seat, that's generally the front. And the line down here is the back. Now with this one, the most common issue is the legs being in the incorrect position. Each leg is labeled one and two, and each track is labeled one and two. So you want those to match up. Leg section one will go in first into track one with leg section two on top, and they're fastened together with a short hand screw and a washer. I'll show you how those washers fit together. Let me unscrew this. If you don't get the legs in the correct position, there'll be two problems. One, the legs, when you're finished building, will appear to be about a half an inch different length. And two, the mounting points up here for the armrests won't appear to stick out the sides of the chair. Rather, they'll appear to stick out the front, so it'll seem like the armrests themselves aren't long enough. But the way that Take the washer and the hand screw, put them together. Normally you can tell by the way the washer is curved which way it should fit onto the tubing. These up here for the long screws will fit with the curve of the washer curved away from the plastic head, curved toward the metal tip of the screw. Put that in, give it a few turns, and it'll be in place. Be all set there. Just remember, section one attaches first, then section two. You'll fit the backrest on. You can tighten down the two leg pieces with the short, but wait until you get the backrest attached before you use those long screws, and you'll be all set. Quick troubleshooting video for the Vive shower chair. I've got this one assembled as you can see. I've got it sort of resting on its back. The triangle part here of the seat, that's generally the front, and the line down here 